Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Nebraska town just infuriated every illegal there with what they'll soon be banned from. The big bad news could be coming soon for illegal immigrants taking advantage of the system, not paying taxes, and ripping off the American taxpayer. A town in Nebraska is majorly considering banning illegal immigrants from some very common things that would basically force them to move out of town. The town is apparently waiting for a new Costco plant to open and they're thinking of banning illegals from renting homes or getting jobs. Some people might see this as a horrible thing to do. But the bright side of it is that it guarantees jobs and homes for the working-class American citizens. If this goes through, then American citizens won't lose jobs to people who broke the law to enter America. The illegals in that town of Scribner must be absolutely infuriated. Liberals must be throwing a fit too, but those are the same big-mouth protesters who wouldn't dare allow a family of illegals to live in their home, they just go outside and scream about it while secretly being intolerant and discriminatory. Keep in mind that some people say illegal and some people say undocumented, but what's the difference? A Nebraska town is considering blocking undocumented immigrants from obtaining jobs or renting houses ahead of a new Costco plant opening in the area. The Scribner City Council has already approved an ordinance that would prohibit the hiring and renting of homes to undocumented immigrants. In order for the measure to pass, it just needs one more approving vote, and Scribner Mayor Ken Thomas said it has the support of the community. I have not had one person come up to me and question what's going on, Thomas said. Scribner, located about 60 miles northwest of Omaha, has a population of less than 900 people. About 96% of those people are white, according to census data. A new Costco plant is set to open in the area next year that will employ approximately 1,000 people, meaning new residents will likely come to the area for job opportunities. The American Civil Liberties Union ACLU, of Nebraska is considering legal action because the policy invites racial profiling and risks increased harassment and discrimination, Danielle Conrad, the group's executive director, told the Associated Press. If Mayor Ken Thomas has the support of his people, then what's the problem with it? That sounds a lot better than running a sanctuary city where the violent illegals aren't forced out and the citizens aren't protected. Wouldn't you rather live somewhere that has a mayor who puts citizens first instead of those who broke the law? Sanctuary cities have caused problems in so many urban areas in America. Everything from violence, drugs, and people losing lives thanks to the Democrat mayors who allow violent criminals to stay in their city as a safe place while ironically making it a not-so-safe place for everyone who legally lives there. Even though legality is just a label. It's the fact that Democrat mayors don't get tough on the violent illegal immigrants and it's Democrat mayors who enable the violent people to remain in their city. We already have enough violence coming from our own people. Some Americans are violent and we can't escape that. If we could kick them out of America, then trust me, everyone would be up for it. However, legally we cannot remove citizens from their country, but we can put them in jail. We can legally remove illegal immigrants from the country, so why are some Democratic mayors so bent on protecting them? If Mayor Ken Thomas goes through with this, then he will probably face some sort of backlash from liberals who are either bust in or flown in. Some big-name player will likely pay for their transportation and have them resist and disrupt the movement, even though it appears as though the town supports the movement for the betterment of their own people. Following the law is a big deal in this country, so people should make it a big deal to them as well. Get legal and have nothing to worry about. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.